Hello Taurus, this is your mid-July 2018 reading. It will not resonate with all Taurus individuals. With that said, let's get to it. I need a reading for Taurus, mid-July 2018. I need a reading for Taurus, mid-July 2018. Five card, five card spread for Taurus. The ball's been going well. I've been trying to get these out as much as I can. I've been doing some other projects that I have going on in my life, so but I do try to get these out. So overall beginning energy, strength. It's a that's the nine of wands, it's strength. It's be able to carry burdens, uh, regaining strength, regaining your health, um, just regaining finances. Could be anything. Family settings. But in the past, you were a little worried. It's in reverse, so you were coming out of it possibly. Let's find out. Five of Pentacles, why are you in reverse for Taurus? That's the past. Why are you? Why are you in the past for Taurus? Mid-July 2018. Could be a love. I'm going to keep that like that. You can be worried over love. Or coming out of worry over love, too. Give me another card for Taurus. For uh, Five of Pentacles and the Two of Cups. Maybe there was some type of injustice was done. Saw this in another sign. It's uh, the Justice card. It's in reverse, so you may be coming out of feeling that too. But it could be that you're also stuck in an injustice. Injust Someone done, had done you an injustice, and you're stayed in, you could be like stuck in, in a worry, in worry mode. It's like you can't get out of it. It could be over love. Let's see. What's the obstacle? Taurus, what is the obstacle? You're not taking a break from something. Maybe you need a rest. It's the Four of Swords. It's in reverse. It's also known as the Truce card. It's also known as taking a break, taking a rest, regaining your health. It's in reverse. So maybe you need to rest up. Because of the, remember, the beginning energy was about strength. Get the Four of Swords in reverse as the obstacle. Why are you there for Taurus? Why are you there for Taurus? Getting that for a lot of the signs. This ten of coin is really out there. Doesn't matter how much I shuffle, it just wants to keep on popping out. And everybody has like a few cards dealing with other signs, so you may want to check those out. But the Ten of Pentacles in the upright. But it's the obstacle. So it could that you just don't have the finances and, and maybe you're overworking because you're not taking a break. You're not you're not regaining strength possibly. You, you should. The overall beginning energy says to regain your strength. But let's find out. Four of Swords reverse, Ten of Pentacles. Why are you there as the obstacle? Hmm. Could have to do with the contract work, could have to do with family, status quo, government. Maybe some of you owe the government. Maybe you have a contract you need fulfilling. Maybe that's why you're overworking because you got obligations, family obligations, partner obligations. But anyway, let's go to the current environment for Taurus. Taurus, current environment for Taurus. Current environment for Taurus. You're not moving on from troubled waters. You're staying stuck in the mud. Six of swords in reverse. So you're staying stuck. You're, you're overworking possibly. Or so even some of you may not be working enough. That could be it too. It's either or. Some of you are working too much and some of you just maybe don't have nothing coming in. But you're stuck. You have the six of swords in reverse. As currently you're stuck. Trying to come out of it, flying under the radar. Maybe some people did some sneaky things to you in the past. Let me get another card. 
Six of Swords, Seven of Swords. Please do not give me the Eight of Swords. I haven't had that in any of the spreads so far, Eight of Swords. Queen of Discs. You're feeling stuck. This could be your energy. As you know, it could be an Earth energy. The Queen of Discs. It could be also a Virgo or Capricorn. But I'm thinking it's your energy. You're feeling stuck. You might have found out some sneaky behavior, something underhanded. Let's see what's coming towards you. I'm hoping it's getting better as we go along. What is coming towards Taurus? Give me something positive. What is coming towards Taurus? Change. Change is coming towards you. Two of Pentacles. You may get another offer. You also may be juggling two different things at the same time. You may feel a little hopeless over a lover, though. Change is coming over a hopeless situation with a lover. Possibly. Give me one more card for that since two of these fell out. Another card for the Two of Pentacles. Could also have to do with the Queen of Swords. This Queen of Swords doesn't have to be a female. It could be male or female. It could be a... a Air energy, they are in reverse. So someone's coming towards you. Maybe someone's wanting change with you. Bringing change that was possibly a hopeless situation. Could be a past lover. Could be an air sign. Could be a Aries. Not Aries. Aquarius. Gemini. Libra. They're coming towards you. I don't think it's what they're thinking. What they're, or what they're thinking of you. Sometimes it's what people think that you're thinking, but it could be that maybe you think things are hopeless and you're wanting change, but it could be that someone's coming towards you that wants change with you that you thought was hopeless. Now, the outcome. Let's get a good outcome for Taurus. What is the outcome for Taurus? Holding money back, holding yourself back, holding finances back to yourself, keeping things to yourself, Four of Pentacles, upright. I need another card for the Four of Pentacles in the upright. Holding back, because you have to. This is Knight of Discs. It's in reverse. Still your energy, possibly. Could be another, like I said, Earth sign. But it's like someone's holding back because they're trying to regain stability. Because they're turned around. They're, they're, they're having trouble keeping things afloat. I need another card for the Four of Pentacles and the Knight of Disc in reverse. The Knight of Disc is in reverse. The Four of Pentacles, like I said, is in the upright. But I need another card. Someone may be making you an offer, though. The Knight of Cups. Now, this could be a person. A lot of times it is with me. But it's also someone making a pretty decent offer. The Knight of Cups could be a water energy, could be a, a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. And you see, I'm going to show you. See, they're offering something. Usually it's a, it's a nice offer. It's like friendship. It could be a gift. It could be like anything, a job offer. It could be a love offer. It could be so many different things. It's, it's, what it does have is emotion. I usually associate this with cancer, but it can be any of them because of the fact that we're doing a mass reading here. I need more information. You're holding things back. Things are tight. And this Knight of Cups may come along and offer you something. Maybe that's what you're waiting for also. Let me get another uh, card for this. For the Four of Pentacles. Knight of Cups. Why are they there? We already know what the Knight of Disc is. Prince of Cups. I'm thinking it has something to do with this. these energies. you got a lot of turnaround energies. I don't think of what else it could be. you got this, to me, a lot of times is a Scorpio card. I get this in my own readings. There's Scorpio. It's in reverse. So I'm thinking some of you may have a Cancer Pisces coming to you. You definitely may have a Scorpio coming towards you in the in the reverse. That could be why you're kept in reverse. And you're kind of holding things back. You're not letting things out. You may take control. The Emperor. A lot of times it's also an Aries. We've got a lot of people here. But uh, 
you're holding back, like I said, but there's an offer coming. Wait for the offer, maybe possibly a Pisces or Cancer, um, and take control. The Emperor's about taking control. Let me get one more card. One more card for Taurus. Yeah, coming out of oppression. So you're going to take control. Get rid of the negatives that are in your life or, or try to turn it around and focus on what's coming towards you that's going to offer you something and possibly bring you out of an oppressive situation if you take control. Someone is also, you're still holding back. you got the Ace of Swords. It's like someone's holding back what they want to say. And you're feeling stuck. You could be stuck over here. You know? You got change coming away with someone's wanting change with you possibly. I'm thinking you got some money situations going on you're, and you're holding back. You got to hold back. But an offer is coming. A different offer that may help you coming out of oppression. But I think the key is you better take control with the emperor. And, and don't hold back. I think it, what it is you're holding back too much. So. That's going to be mid-July, mid a little bit on for that. We also have Mercury retrograde. It's going to cause a lot of disturbances with a lot of people. But you're going to be okay if you take control of whatever situation is occurring with finances or family or loved ones that are around you. And that is your reading, Taurus, and I'll let that go. Bye.